We're bang over today. Um, so today we're headed to Walmart to get some coffee creamer. More creamer to go with my coffee. It's, it's the almond to go to go with my homemade Starbucks coffee. Mm -hmm. so it's the almond creamer kind, so I took it with me, so I won't forget. And then what else we supposed to be getting? Um, I think that's it. I think we got everything yesterday. We just didn't get that. But um, uh, so we should be good. Grab that, as in the words of Will, grab and go, <laughs> grab and go. But I'm gonna actually stop at the counter. So he missed that whole concept. So yeah. And then, as y'all know, yeah, we cooking fish. We supposed to be having the fish on by one, but I don't think that's gonna work out. We end up going to bed. <coughs> Excuse me. We end up going to bed late. Last night it was like three o'clock. We were watching scary movies because that's what we do. We love scary movies. Mm -hmm. So we watched scary movies last night till about three, and so that kept us in the bed a little longer than we expected. We expected, right? So. Yeah, so we, which, we'll, one, which Walmart are we going to? Just just a quick quick in and out, we're straight we're straight across the street. I don't like the Walmart. I like the big. One. Well, this well, you okay? You gonna be okay? <laughs> um, so we'll call y'all back once we get there. Okay, you guys, I'm going to see if I can actually come in here and just get one thing. Because you know how that Walmart store run can be. You just need that one thing, and then you end up with four, five, six, seven, maybe 10, 12 items. So, we're going to see how this goes. So, they do have my, the kind that I like, this one. I can get it out. Yeah. This is the can that I was looking for. So, I really do think this is the only thing I need. But no, I don't think we have enough ketchup. It just dawned on me. I just thought about that. So, here's the one extra item. Here go with the one extra item. So, we're definitely not gonna need a basket. I'm gonna stamp that. I'm gonna stamp that. We're not gonna get a basket. This is all we're gonna need. Two items. Two, two. Creamer, ketchup. Uh, call him and see if we need anything. I don't even think he even started cooking yet to even know if anything is needed. So, you know. Oh, so, yeah, see? No, we don't need, we need cups and we need whipped cream. See, now we don't went to one, to add none, three additional items we practice look do we think we have enough forks um, just get just get just get the box of those white forks see we went one two three four now we're finna grab the fifth item see it never fails it never fails oh i think so because we only had that one. Oh my god see this point is a what I said, none basket point, but I think we're still good. We get the gallon. Let's, let's get that. Let's get that one. No, let's get the 20. So at this point, we're still out of the don't need a basket range, and I'm going to keep it that way because I'm, I'm sure this is the last thing we need once I get the. Um, whipped cream. 
So let me grab the ripped cream. They got the great value. This looks dirty. Yeah. <laughs> Just something with the writing on it or something. Let me see. I think it's the writing or something on it. Let me grab one from the back. I think this all of them like that, but I think it's just something with the blue writing. They got the little stuff for sale. Oh, it's like a little baby for a pool. I always like to look and see what they have for sale because I'm big on shopping kind of early for Christmas and see what I can buy now and put back. Total for this trip was $19.92. So $20, so it, was, it wasn't too bad. So let me pay and I'll call y'all back. Okay, we're done. I think we end up with maybe five more items. Five or six more items than the number one that we intended to go in and get. But, you know, that's how trips are Walmart always in. So, we're headed back home. Get our day going. Get our day started cooking. So, yeah. We'll call y'all back. Okay, you guys, this is what I use to make my Starbucks at home. Today was definitely not going to be a Starbucks run day because, you know, they can get out, and get out of hand with the prices and stuff. But, so, this right here is my second go-to. So, basically, it's pretty simple. I normally use my other clip cup, but my daughter had already used it this morning. So, you just kind of pour the iced coffee delight vanilla in. I already have my ice in my cup. Kind of halfway. Not too, not too much because you got to leave room for your almond cream. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it good, mix it up. And I don't use a lot of this because I really don't like it to be sweet, sweet, but sweet. Just about that much. Then, Sometimes I easily put the, the caramel on the bottom, on the side to the cup, but like I said, you can't see it anyway. So just put a little bit on top, shake the whipped cream, shake it real good. And I don't know if people say caramel or caramel. I'm not sure what's the correct thing to say. Sometimes I just say whatever pops in my head. You know what I'm talking about. You know what I mean. Shake it. Just kind of finish it up with a little. With cream. On top and then this little squirts of the whipped cream. I mean, the um, caramel on the top. And that's my Starbucks at home. So you guys, my sister-in-law just left. She just came from my in-law's house. And they know we love my mother-in-law's dressing because it's like fire, it's the bone. It's like the best hands down. So she fixed some this morning, today. I guess a part of, it's part of their Sunday dinner. And she sent us some back. Oh, I'm like, thank you, God. Thank you, even though we're having fish and stuff today, fish fry. This can be put in the refrigerator to go with the meal, maybe tomorrow. These are the potatoes. I'm going to season them so he can put them in the grease. Okay, um, you guys, we're back. We got the peeled potatoes. They are seasoned, washed, seasoned real good. So we just waiting on the grease to get hot before we drop those. And then these are the seasons that we use. Trader Joe's, smoked paprika. I really love Trader Joe's. I only went one time, but it's like, it's a cool little spot. So I need to go back more often, but yeah. Garlic powder, cayenne pepper, seasoning and salt, not too much salt, but we just sprinkle this a little bit. We got the nitrous season, onion powder, 
and slap your mama Cajun seasoning. And you you know, these two are the the staple. You know, this goes on everything, if you didn't know. So I always keep that stock in your pantry because they are staples, okay? Garlic and onion. <laughs> we literally put this in everything that it calls for. Not everything, but just that. And disregard this, this is my son's snack for the week. I just grabbed him a box of Doritos. Let's see how long he gonna last without saying, Mom, I'm tired of Doritos every day. So hopefully we can get him through this week with Doritos. But yeah, we'll call y'all back when we start cooking. Here is the onions that we want to use. These are really, really good. It's kind of got like a sweet taste on them. So yeah, these are the ones we normally get. I haven't really seen them in Walmart. Normally it's like, we saw them yesterday at Piggly Wiggly and like save a lot, I think. But they are good. So, just the ones we normally get. These are all our seasonings. seasonings. The sins to the side, we use them already. We just gotta put them up. Uh, uh, okay, this is the guy. This, the, this is the um, corn. I just put it on and I ain't even started boiling yet. But we just use regular water, some milk, stick of butter, and seasoning. Um. So yeah, it's gonna be boiling pretty soon. And Dad is making the homemade tartar sauce. This is the grease. Uh, we at the right temperature, 350. So the first thing we're dropping is the cut potato. tell you to make this a rap video yeah yeah and and playing my game he's cutting the, uh, the onions to get to go in the batter let's get the batter a little flavor we already put some of the onion in the uh rewind we've already put some of the onion in the tartar sauce that's already homemade we tasted it and it is good it's the tartar sauce it's just a little cup. We ain't make a lot. It's pretty good. I think the best tartar sauce that I've tasted is at this fish place that's in our hometown. This is the fish. I already cleaned. It's the whole fish. Uh, we just kind of let it in. like the whole fish to be like wet, wet when we get ready to batter it. So we like to make sure it's draining real, real good. Put the napkin on to catch any of the excess water. And then we'll season it. Um, Get the grease hot, and then we'll start cooking. So we'll call that back. We're back, and we're leaving the house because we have to go to where? Walmart again. Walmart. I tell you guys, Walmart is like our literally our second home. Yeah, you know? mm -hmm. like for real, for real. So we're going back to Walmart. Only this time it's not for me. My husband needs some stuff from the store. So we picked up his items. And this time I, I got to go to the big Walmart because of the stuff oh. that he needs. So yeah, we'll be going to the big Walmart there, get the things that's needed, and we will. Oh, <laughs> bless you. Thank you. They've been having allergies every morning since been since since August. You know, kids do not get sick during the summer. June and July, they're not sick. August hit, and there we go, you know. And there we go with the allergies, the stomach aches, 
headaches, back aches. The back aches? Anything they can think of. As soon as August 1st hits, kids get sick. But, whatever. <laughs> so we're gonna hit y'all back as soon as we make it to our destination. So, it was a hot second and we'll call y'all back. Okay, you guys, we are still in the process. I'm done with the one. I am over it. O V E R. Allowing the man to cook, allowing the man to be in your kitchen is. I mean, like, at this point, do I just want to take over and, and, and just say, just, just sit, just sit down. I got this. Or I continue on to allow him to do what he thinks he's doing. I'm over it. I am over it. I had to stop because he's walking. He's in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. Bring me this past bit. Give me the pan. Turn the oven on. Is it ready yet? Taste it. It's doing some more seasoning. Put the seasoning on it. So, yeah. That's basically how this cooking fish thing is going. He's basically just turning over in the grease. But we're handing, we're seasoning, we are fixing, we're whipping, we are keeping warm, we're tasting. We're doing all that. So, we'll see you guys so like i said we had fish onion rings potatoes the homemade tartar sauce ketchup that is the louisiana hot sauce that's on my fish we had the corn one of these pieces are my husband's i just took it out to kind of cool down then we had the coke but yeah that is the dinner for today Clean his fish. I won't see how he do it, but he cleaned it. <laughs> <laughs>